has not been released, but initial reports suggest Mary in Blackhead. The remainder of Mayor Ryan's killed by his deputy mayor and closest associate, Weldon Holt. Holt has also announced to run for mayor in the upcoming election. Today, It. You do not look so bad. Then, in the car, I doubted you would survive. Why'd you help me anyway? I needed you to leave. That hasn't changed. This about the biochip? That why I'm here? Hmm. I hear it's damaged beyond the repair. Any attempt to extract it would be disastrous. Fatal for you. Vic likes to talk, I guess. Not many could do what he did. You should be thankful. What's it you actually want from me? To begin, you must tell me where to find Evelyn Parker. Evelyn? What's she to you? She and Yorino Varasaka had intimate relations. She knows how to get to him. You thinking I ought to have a word with her myself? She promised to help me get rid of the chip. I would not count on that. She's likely gone very far away. Why you figure she skipped town? I tried to locate her, but had no success. I suspect she covered her tracks. You said Parker could help you remove the relic. Does she work for a corporation? Got no clue. Evelyn was knowledgeable about the relic. Had a large chunk of classified info. An enigma to be sure. But she showed that slyness he get in corporal agents. You know the kind. I too possess this slyness you speak of. You got tossed out, lumped with the outcasts, easily. Or have you forgotten? Hmm. <sighs> Sorry I couldn't be of any help. Don't have any time to lose, so... Hey, wait. I need you. Yorinobu Arasaka must answer for this crime of patricide. <laughs> Looking for justice. In Night City. I seek revenge. Much more feasible here. I have allies prepared to bring Yorinobu to his knees. The only thing I need is proof. And you think... They'll trust the word of a merc. I have nothing better now. Also, I know no one here. And I am a fugitive. I am hunted. What if I say no? Then I will tell you what rewards await if you help me. So what? We stroll into Arasaka HQ and announce that Yorinobu's a kin killer? That he murdered Saburo? We'll get the hearing before reasonable people. In a neutral location. Certain procedures will be used to establish the truth. A lie detector? Forget it. In that case, another option. You are dying. You do not know how to save yourself. A chip, the relic, is a culprit. Technology made by Arasaka. Technology they alone know. This corporation can save you as easily as it can make you disappear. It is merely about getting the right people on your side. Politics. Exactly what kind of people are we talking about? People who hold Arasaka dear are ah, its heart. People interested in the corporation's stable growth. You mean people like Anders Hellman? You know this name? How? 
prepped for the heist, thoroughly. Relic is Hellman's design, his creation. And true, he's a pole. I was thinking of one much more powerful. Besides, Anders Hellman escaped to Arasaka, betrayed it. Now, Hanako-sama, I would first like to ask you... Fucking Saka scums everywhere. Hey, I was listening to that. Shut up. Nobody except you wants to watch that shit about that corpo cunt. What did you say? You heard me. Let go, Takamura. At least one of you's got some fucking sense. Tom's all right. Not afraid to speak his mind, that's all. He reminds me of my father. He also worked in a kitchen all his life. Last thing we want to do is to draw attention. I'm sorry. A stupid reflex. Thanks for the offer. Need to think about it. Get back to you. I need time to plan, organize. You stand to gain much if you help me. All I ask is that you do not leave the city. Leave? Why would I leave? Need help. Best chance I'll find the right person here. Someone other than Arasaka specialist? There's no one. No alternative. Actually, we just talked about some. With a bit of luck, I'll track down Evelyn. If she could not help you before, she would not manage to now. Honor among thieves. Ever heard of it? Yes. I thought it ironic. Thieves have none. There's just honor. I believe. Your noble Arasaka would agree, I'm sure. The Parker woman will not help you. Why are you? I would think about the plan B. Anders Hellman. He invented the relic. If I want to get rid of it, he's my man. And if that means picking another fight with Arasaka, so be it. Hellman defected from the company. I myself spent many days looking for him. He... What's the expression? Dropped off the face of the earth. Somebody's been busy the last few days. I will not sit and do nothing when there is information to be found. Things to prepare. Your job, basically. It was my job. Why are you looking for Hellman? He was the one to alert Saburo-san to Yorinobu's schemes. He knew both of them well and could be an important witness. Corporal rats will squeal when hanging by their tails. For several days, I collected the information. All leads point to one place. The club called the Afterlife. I was quickly dismissed by the Queen of Fixers there. Rogue. She take you for a suit? No. She saw me as Saburo-sama's killer. Rogue's well informed. Gets wind of most things that happen in the city. Might be worth asking her about Hellman. I wish you luck. The old man is choosy, expensive, and rude. I cannot stay here any longer. Do what you want. Look for Parker, Hellman, whoever. I must see some friends, call in some favors. When my people in Arasaka are ready to listen, I will call you. Till then, I guess. If by some miracle you find Hellman, please notify me. He and I have unfinished business. Zapper dumples and filth. In some ways, Night City never changes. 
Oh, Sokka's still a despotic machine, and the world's on a collision course with chaos. But hey, at least Rogue's still alive. You know, you got some nerve. First you had to kill me, now you want to be my pal. Make like nothing happened. You know you don't gotta speak out loud to talk to me. What do you want? And I've processed some shit, changed my mind. Don't want you dead anymore. Go fuck yourself, dickwipe. Hey, wasn't easy for me either. You woke up in a landfill, I woke up in your head. Wrestling with your thoughts, memories. Think we're even. And I've taken a step back, looked at things. Think we might be able to help each other. We could start with Rogue. Her and I go back to the Stone Age. Why should I trust you? Remind me again. Trust me, don't trust me. I don't give a fuck. It's the least of our worries, anyway. You're the ghost of Christmas past, asshole. Any friends you had are either dead or so old their memory's gone. Johnny Silverhand died a legend. Nobody forgets that. So you fucking know Rogue. What do I say to her? Got a talking brain tumor claims it's her old friend Johnny? Trust me, Rogue's heard dumber shit than that. Way back when you weren't even an itch in your daddy's ball sack. Don't need convincing. Seeing your memories, gross. Rogue will dance to any tune I play or just get us to the afterlife. There is no us. Hey, look. Would you look at that? 
You see it too, right? I've either gone completely whacked or I'm having a mystical moment. What's that chick's name? The one with the hair? Misty? Eh, more likely a neuron misfire for Victor to check out. Or maybe I ask them both. Before. Got a good memory for faces. Bar's closed. Sorry, Chief. How's Biz going? Why? Think you can shake things up? Just passing the time with Convo. Gee, I'd love to, but in case you haven't noticed, I'm working. Need to talk to Evelyn Parker. Hmm. Not here right now. It's been a while since she has been, actually. You know where she's to be found? I ain't her BFF. Better off asking Judy. Evelyn, anyone else you might have poured her heart out to? Do I look like her psych doc to you? How about Judy? She in her den? Yep. Take the stairs down. I'll let Judy know you're coming. Start again. What is it you want us to do now? Speak some sense into it. That don't work. I don't know. You led. I, I don't care. I just want my room back. Your pimp threw you out, that it? Told me I was generating losses and just said, have a nice life and slam the damn door. I don't got nowhere to sleep tonight. Please? You? Shit. Thought you were gone. You're not alone in thinking me dead. Thought it was game over for me too. Things went ass up, huh? Not as planned. Her kidding. You heard about the heist, I take it. Must have uh talked to Evelyn. Didn't need to. Old damn city's heard. Listen, need to find Evelyn. I really don't want to talk about her. You know where she is? What'd I just say? Drop it. I won't tell you again. Judy, you're my one hope. The only lead I got. I gotta find her. And I know you can help me do that. Who told you I want to? Can we meet? Let's meet, please. You at Lizzie's? Hey, where are you going? Nothing to see back here. Stop telling every joy toy you need to come here. The hell I'm supposed to do with them all? You so concerned about strays? Go take care of your guests. Suze, we're not done here. Oh yeah, we fucking are. You just don't give up, do you? Got nothing more to say to each other. Susie seems to know what she wants. She your boss? You come all this way just to play who's who at the mocks? What was that all about? Everyone in this city lives in their own goddamn bubble. And either you fly high or sink into quicksand. Listen, have you seen Evelyn? I need to talk to her. It's important. Why? So you can make her your scapegoat for your train wreck of a heist. Seem to know how the heist went. Meaning you did talk to her. I know how you fucked up. Got all your Doombas killed like a real pro. You played your part in this fiasco too. Heist wouldn't have ever got off the ground without you messing in her BD. You two hazed me for fuck's sake. Both of you. Whole thing stank. Said it from the start. You do this for fun? Talking around in circles? I'm trying to make this simple. Just tell me where she is. Why can't you? I don't trust you. That's simple. You really want to pull the victim card? Can't see a single scratch on you. 
Fine. Looks like we're all in this piss pot together. But you're desperate. Writing's on your face. Excuse me? I came here with a simple question. You're the one making me desperate if I am. Maybe instead of judging, you could just tell me where she is. All right, enough. Get lost. You care so much. Find clouds. Look there. And where's clouds? Sig case on my desk's got the address. Just take it and go. Mega Tower. Luxurious. What's clouds? A dollhouse. But can't say I like your chances if you don't know that much. Read the streets. Evelyn's there. You know this. Or are you guessing? Saw it in the tarot. Now ghosts before I call the girls. Hold on. A dollhouse? Evelyn a regular there? Or a drone? Closed. Don't you have somewhere to be? Heated exchange there with Judy. What was that all about? How's this any of your business? Gonna follow up with your own sermon on responsibility for others? Go on, your high horse is waiting. I'm just curious. One thing I know about curiosity won't get you shit unless you got the fists and the ass to back it up. You know what happened to Evelyn Parker? Why are you asking me? You talked to Judy about her already. Sure, but you're the boss. You might know something more. Evelyn jumped the mock ship a long time ago. And anyone not a mox is not my damn problem. I'm guessing the club brings in a lot of biz. Pisses at share a cost, too. Why, looking to invest? Nah, I'm just admiring your operation. We took over this place way back when. Every day I wake up and wonder how it's still standing. We get by, that's all I'll say. Where do you give the working girls a helping hand? That's ancient history. And like all history, it was pretty damn bloody. What was it? Something about a riot. Joy girl murdered by a tiger claw? Not the first, just the one that tipped the scales. Folk went ballistic. Streets overflowed with raised fists. Girls, pimps, outcasts, the whole freak show. It's how the mocks got started. But that's old news. We're running a business now, not a charity. Can't help everyone in this city. Gotta take care of our own. Moxes come first. Forget Evelyn. Admit it. This is about Judy's virtues, isn't it? Good shit, if I say so myself. They call me Mr. Hands. If you're looking for Pacifica jobs, call me. Name V. And what? No, pleased to meet you? I'm truly honored to meet you. You got any biz? Call me.
Council of Night City absolved 32... Kaku Akata, Lady of Westbrook Estate. When you find a moment, come see me. We must settle our accounts for Sandra Dorset. You did quite well, you and that friend of yours. Until then. Taking out my way. Way I see it, only thing waiting for you here is getting off or getting off. Place your bets. What if I miss this time, enlighten me. Brain dance chick is hiding something. No coincidence, we already saw two tiger claws. They must control the building. Arasaka and the Tiger Claws are in bed together. Go figure. Every corpse plays dirty. Except the streets are more than that. They're filth. So the corpse leave it to the gang. Suits collars and gets soiled. Surprised? No, I mean... Fevel? know what you're looking for. Would you care to jack into the terminal? Looking for Evelyn Parker. Does she work here? 
Give me a moment. Evelyn's not available at this time. Need to see her. It's important. The algorithm knows best. Trust me, it will choose a doll that will thrill you. Our dolls can change their hair and eye color in real time to look just as you wish. I'm not a customer. Well, all the more reason to be excited. There's a first time for everyone at Clouds. It's no reason to dawdle. All you need to do is jack in. We'll create your personal profile and you'll be good to go. Huh. I'm sorry, did she finally say anything useful? Fuck the menu, let's ditch this waitress and take our special order to the chef, point blank. Meaning? Meaning you go in as a customer, keep a low profile. They want to keep their cards close, fine. We'll play our own game. How could you possibly know what I'm looking for? Clouds always knows. Your deepest desire? We find it. You'll have your needs fulfilled. And maybe much more. Less is not a word we use around here. So how's this all work? An algorithm pilots the doll's motor functions. It takes your profile data and transforms into... experiences in real time. Memory dampers on the doll's behavioral chip block any recall of the session. So there'll be no trace of the meeting? Well, I could say yes, but that would strip it of mystery and suspense, wouldn't it? Once you're in there, you set the stakes. You're saying it's not dangerous, but there's some risk involved. That is one way to put it. One thing is for sure. You never get what you expect. Consider my interest peaked. All right, let's do this. This will be a live session, so events may take an unexpected turn. But don't quit if you feel uncomfortable. You could miss out on something truly remarkable. If you feel unready to handle what comes next, you can interrupt the session immediately. Now for your safe word. Samurai. And saved. Now bear with me a moment. Scanning your personal profile. You should see compatible dolls in just a second. Two matches. Interesting. Is that normal or...? Who can say what is normal? You're clearly a unique person with... Unique tastes. Our system can handle it. So who will it be? Angel or Sky? Rather go with Sky. I couldn't have chosen better myself. Now for the payment, and you'll venture into the clouds. There you go. The payments come through. The entire floor is open to you if you wish to wind down first. Sky awaits you in booth nine. Disconnect, please. Is that it? <clears throat> we have a strict no weapons policy here at Clouds. Please deposit any and all hazardous items with me. Only two willing to spread their legs for you. Sad. Go eat a dick, Johnny. You won't find any use for weapons inside. Thank you. We hope you enjoy your stay. Guess that makes you a... Hi, I'm Sky. And you must be... Vincent? V. Just V. Only people who know me real well can use my real name. Okay, then. V. Welp, 
Looks like this will be interesting. So, V, you're dying. How'd you know I'm dying? Deep inside. You fear this. Cower before it. So what if I do? Why do you care? Of all the voices in your head, the loudest is that calling for help. Look around. All of this is your doing. Samurai. Oh, what's going on? Goddamn thing threw me out. Need to talk to you. Talk? You pulled the emergency brake, ripped me out just to talk? What happened? I do something wrong? Evelyn Parker, what do you know about her? Not much. Everyone's got their own booths, their own problems. Their own little bubbles. It's a fragile ecosystem. People like you, Barjan, violate it, try to rearrange. No. Answer the question. Do it. And then you can get back to whatever it is you do. Here's what I don't do. Spill to any rando who walks in here. How about those good looks of yours? Be a shame if they dip below club standards. Anything out of the ordinary happened here lately? Fine. Heard a customer did a number on her. But that's all I know. Shit like that happens around here way more often than anybody would care to admit. You ought to ask Tom. Two of them were inseparable, gossiping for hours on end. The customer attacked her. I guess. I don't know. Real mess that was. Security barged in, handled it. Things went silent. You don't go around asking questions here. Better off not seeing, not hearing. Keeping your head down. Where did it happen? Her booth. Told you. She was with a client. Gonna just stand there or tell me a number. Eleven. Need to get inside that booth somehow. Yeah, and do what? None of your biz. Can you open it or not? Sure. Just don't bother me again. Ever. Talk to Tom. Who's Tom? A doll. Like the rest of us. What do you think? An XBD star? Where'll I find him? VIP area. Booth 2, I think. Thanks. See? You turn out to be useful after all. motherfucking week you're not authorized to access the vip area oh yes i am no sir you're not you can take it up with the manager no dog i'm taking it up with you here now you got any idea who i am is there a problem this conk don't understand that i've got a right to be in there from what i can see your vip membership has been revoked say what now please stay calm sir we're going to have to escort you outside. Oh. I'll see. You're going back upstairs? In a minute. It's a piss burst.
course I'm in, in evil capacity. <laughs> yeah, I have that bike. I know where to be. What will you have? Anything? You better keep this short and sweet. Two brainwashed sex zombies in a single day is too much. Even for me. Hi! Um, I think something might have gone wrong here. Not really sure, uh... I don't have your details? Sorry, no idea what I'm supposed to do. Relax. You don't need any data, don't need any deets. I'm not a customer. I'm here to talk. To you specifically. Not to be with a doll. Tom, is that it? Uh-huh. I need to get in touch with Evelyn Parker. It's important. You and me both. Tried calling her a bunch of times. No luck. You mean to say she's not here? She had an accident. Needed to go to a special clinic in Osaka. Or Oslo. I think it was Oslo. For a new faceplate. Which was it? Osaka or Oslo? Oh, yeah, I'm good. Got to uh, Oslo. Hardware. Yeah, definitely <laughs> Oslo. Motorcycle, not motor... Tell you herself oh, she was skipping town? Motor... Uh... Nah, just didn't show up for work. Wasn't picking up either, so I asked Woodman what was up. Told me she left, like I said. Where can I find this Woodman? Probably got his feet up in the back. Except it's off limits to customers. Woodman, who is he? Mr. Forrest. But everybody calls him Woodman. Never really known why. Okay, Mr. Forrest, then. What's his thing? He's kind of like our caretaker. Finds new talent, deals with ugly situations. Got it. Could it be Woodman finally shed some light on this shit show? Man can only dream. The skull sponges in these dolls. Ugh. That's what they should be replacing. Yeah, I'm good. Got some new hardware. <laughs> Motorcycle, not motor. A washing machine has a motor. Uh... Can we?
するぜ Have you ever heard of Jotaro Shobo? He's one of the tea claws. Yeah, I've heard. A fox Looks familiar. What's that? Evelyn's jacket. It's crumpled like a tissue. He must have been here a while. That's all pretty fun. But so what? Athletes like Shobo have been on my blacklist before I heard of him. The Mock's blacklist is more powerful. It actually means something. I'll believe it when I see his rotting, stinking corpse. Amen to that. Hold it there, honey. You seem to be in the wrong place. Hey, no peeking. Bad luck seeing us like this. No clients allowed in here. Bear Chum and close the door on your way out, would you? Or as you can see, I'm very busy. Looking for a girl named Evelyn Parker. Got nobody working here by that name. But she used to. What happened to her? Probably did what all the dolls try to do. Found a unicorn to set her up for life. Nah, you could do better. Try Roxy over at Booth, too. Same heart shaped ass. Behavioral chip will do the rest. Won't feel any difference. 
Don't have time for your games. Need to know where Evelyn is. We're running a skin circus here, in case you haven't noticed. Not a missing persons bureau. Let me guess. You played with the doll once or twice, and now you want to run off into the sunset. Go down to reception, they'll find your soulmate 2.0 in even fewer seconds than that. You look to me like a reasonable man. I think we can work something out. And you look to me like a psycho prick who's never been ghosted by his bow or bill before. But go on. I'm listening. You've got info, I've got eddies. It's a fair trade. What's your price? You need to pull your head out of your ass. Eddies will buy your horse here, not snitches. I look like either of those to you. Had a look at the menu here and no. You don't look a thing like these meat puppets. More like a Joy Boy's cum rag. You... Insolent fuck! <laughs> You're the king of fuck-ups. You're not helping. Now what? Hell, why don't you just scan the truth from his gray lifeless... That just might work. Busted. Could have sent her to get it patched up. A ripper named Fingers in a back alley for hookers. Sounds like a Joy Toy's wet dream.
work back there. Ever thought of applying for the diplomatic corps? Don't have time to massage egos. I respect that. <laughs> of course you do. You'd have loved to have dropped the H-bomb in this place. No need to go so OTC. I've got other methods. One thing's for sure, though. Claus won't forget this. condition to find oh, out. Oh, fuck! What the hell's that? No, 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 no damn, damn it. it! Jesus, what the fuck do you want from me? It's all going too slow. I'm gonna decommission before we learn how to rip the chip out. Wanted me dead. Said so yourself. Made it pretty clear since that I changed my mind. Want you to live now. Asked you already. What the hell you want from me? I got a get out of jail free card. I'd be a fucking fool not to take advantage. See, me and Arasaka, we got a half century old score neat settling. And I plan to do it. That's what I need you for. Never been recruited into a terrorist cell before. Feel Listen, honored, I actually. know things. Where we can save your life, who can help us do that? You'll get rid of the chip. I'll smash Sokka. Win-win, kid. Soul Killer's what we need, and Makoshi's how we grab it. You know you're just an irritating hallucination, right? Should just ignore you. And you're a walking corpse. Should just wait till your mind shrivels to nothing and frees up space for me. You fucking asshole. But it should be obvious. I've decided to help you. Need to find something first. Seven letters. Starts with an M. Okay, so... This Makoshi... What is it exactly? Okay. Basics. If you're jacked in, cruising the net, Arasaka can use Soul Killer, an AI, to trap, fry, and pack away your psyche, your mind, and your soul. Following so far? Yeah, seeing the memories. Did a real number on you. Okay, seems we've got a few more things to broach than I thought, but that'll come later. Anyway, when Soul Killer fries, roasts, and boils you, you die. But the contents of your mind get copied to an engram first. Sure. That's how you became a construct. Exactly. Now, Makoshi's the place Soul Killer operates out of, where it stores its victims' engrams. Still don't see how Makoshi's linked to my chip problem. Not the brightest bulb on stage, are you? 
50 years back, ops on the human mind. Makoshi was the sole place on Earth where they did anything like that. Bet it still is today. Telling you, all roads lead there. It's where we'll settle our biz. You yours, me mine. And, uh, how you plan to smash Arisaka this time? Got another nuke tucked away? This time, bombs named Alt Cunningham. I'm supposed to know who that is? Not yet, but you will once we find what we need. For now, we got no time to lose. Need to get inside, Makoshi. Hey, at least here you know what you're getting. Here, kitty, kitty, what's the rush? important i may have found a solution to the problem we share hey not one i have step established closer. the contact Here's with an old move. friend from arasaka he's here in night city now he's well connected to certain influential people old friend well connected to the influential why so mysterious get to the point I told you once I would explore options, knock on many doors. There will be a meeting, you, me, and this friend of mine. You will tell him what you told me, the truth of events at Kompiki Plaza. I have little hope that he will be convinced, but it will be a start. Of all people, you ought to know Night City tests everyone's reliability, even that of old friends. Sure about this guy? Trust him. Many times we have had the opportunity to kill one another. Yes, I trust him. Fine. Where's the meat and when? Japan Town. After sunset. I am sending you the precise location. I'll see you there. Look, I don't want any trouble. Just let me through. Pretty please. How about you pre-please me? <laughs> all right, all right. Go on. Hey, hands off her. Think I'm scared of your skinny ass? You will be when every locked in town depends on this shithole. You got a financial claim? Take it to court, you Stop pussy. Off and leave me be. Fine, I get it. Everyone's got their breaking points. Made it all the way here, huh? Must really want to talk to Evelyn. Hello! There's a line! Nuh uh, you ain't cutting. Fingers Sit your ass down and wait your turn. Heard some things, yeah. Like. His hand sometimes slips. What are you even doing here, Judy? Same thing as you. Looking for Evelyn. Who paid for all that? Think fingers 
how'd you know to look for Evelyn here? Got friends at Clouds. Word spreads out of there quicker than the clap. Meaning? Friend told me what you dug up, so here I am. After the heist, Evelyn holed up with the Mox for a while, right? That's right. So why the hell she go back to Clouds? <sighs> Thought she'd be safer there. God knows why. Tried to get her to see straight, but she wouldn't listen. This friend of yours, who is it? Tom Caldera. Works as a doll there. Never bothered to mention Evelyn had disappeared when we talked. And then you came around asking questions. Got him scratching his head. Didn't strike me as the brightest bulb in the batch. Sorry, but right now, I could give a shit about what does or does not strike you. Let's just concentrate on finding Evelyn. I'm starting to get worried, seriously. Mocks don't happen to have fingers in their crosshairs. No, why? Heard Joy Toys come out of his clinic in worse shape than they come in. Yeah, well... Can't solve all the world's problems at once. We're gonna be here forever. I just know it. Maybe you could talk to those girls? See if we can cut in front? Why me? I don't think they like me. Just give it a shot. That or come up with something better. I think Evelyn's being kept here somewhere. On the one hand, hope she is, because I want her back fast. But on the other, hope to God, no. Because who knows what that sick fuck could have done to her. She means a lot to you, doesn't she? And you've arrived at that conclusion how, exactly? The moment you knew where she was, you sprang into action. Once you get close to Evelyn, you never want to let her go. You worked at Clouds. Not as a doll. Tuned their virtues. That's where I met Ev, Tom, and the rest of the crew. You see a woman with blue hair around here? Had a doll chip. Uh, think I know who you're talking about. Fingers worked on her, sure. She's still here? No idea. Gotta ask him. I need to talk to him. It's important. You think we're just here to polish our nails, huh? I'll let well, you cut in front of me. You're a real pain in my cleat, Missy. You know that? And you? Might as well knock and find out when he's mopping up. Supposed to be a goddamn clinic. Not in any of your blonde red. Go on now. Don't you worry about her. Come on, let's go. Edges are stretching your optic nerves. Don't worry. Your eyes I think he's adjust. done. We going in? Eventually. Yes? Hello. What can I do for you? Need a minute of your time. A minute? That's all? Shame. Could watch those juicy lips of yours flap for hours, days. <laughs> but I'm busy right now. You tiger claws. Far as I know, I'm all paid up. We're with the Mox. The Mox? Why didn't you say so? So, what brings you here? These girls know you're chipping faulty implants. You might say so. I'd say they're the very best I can find. See? What's in it for you? Whatever they have to offer. And they always have something to offer. <laughs> You're a sick fuck. Know that? What do you two want? Heard you help the working girls around here. Well, very few children will play with broken toys. So when skin goes flabby, sockets go out of whack, implants malfunction, I I'm sure you get the gist. You pay for goods, you expect top quality. Consumerism 101. Please, scrapyards offer better quality than this. Evelyn Parker. I need to know where she is. Step into my office, please. Many girls come through here. So many. 
But let me put it to you this way. I believe in giving each of them the personal touch. Ask anyone. I'm more than a chop doc. See, I know what people truly want. I'll be more than glad to show you around. But, um, uh, later, perhaps. Of course, I can't remember each and every one. Please set your exquisite derrieres down. Suggest you start remembering all you can. Either that, or I'll make sure you never forget my face. Two beefers from a BD studio took her. Didn't even know their names. Want details, damn it. Name the studio. They mentioned a moth, of all things. Virtues with the death's head. Said she'd be good for the moth. Need air. I'll be outside. Let her go back to clouds. Could have stopped her, but I didn't. Don't worry. We'll find her, I know it. We'll fucking find what's left of her butchered corpse. Hey, keep it together. You want to give up now? No. Only lead we got's an XBD. Where's that get us? We also know we're looking for something related to the death's head. It's better than nothing. I don't get your optimism. Still sounds like a big fat nothing to me. Dead said symbol bring anything to mind? Anything. Doesn't matter how small. This industry... I mean, market's looking for every kind of fetish out there. It's cavernous. But an XBD outfit would be on the move almost always. It makes them harder to nab, harder to sting. Need to figure out where they're scrolling this stuff. Gotta be a rat hole of some sort. Doubt they do much shooting on location. Yeah, gotta be somewhere quiet, out of the way. It could be we'll see something to point us in their direction and one of their virtues. Ugh, have to be real gonks to leave a clue. Got a better idea. Matter of fact, I do. A domain called Pleasures of Night City. There's a twin of it on the dark net. Every kind of thing goes on there. Might stumble on something useful. Let me think for a sec. Dark net domain. That's our best bet. Let's stick to the plan. Fine. Here's hoping you turn up something useful. I'll wait in the van. 